absolutely beautiful um, considering it's uh, late October um, it's reasonably mild you can see from my clothes and uh, we've got quite a climb ahead of us and then we're gonna look down into the valleys see see what we can see try and get a nice trophy in the head? Yeah. <laughs> I mean the...
So Dan's just uh, taking a fantastic shot 200 metres across a, a ravine and um, we were after a cull animal this morning for the barbecue and um, we came across a group of mouflon uh, and amongst it was a lamb and they are the tastiest ones uh, he's probably six months old and uh, Charlie got stalked him into it and, and he took a great shot on it uh, however he was on a, aiming on a chest shot weren't you Dan? Yeah. and as he pulled the trigger it turned around to lick his back of his shoulder I didn't get it on film but uh, he's actually shot it cleanly in the head so uh, better, it's even better for the pot Dan well done <laughs> Ah, oh, well done. Fantastic hunt, and I can just turn around now and actually show where we shot it from. Up there. Oh. Shot it from right up there. Just under that. So, fantastic shot, Dan. And I think it's your first move on. First move on. First of many. <laughs> we were actually looking for a big one for his dad. And uh, we saw that all the ones we saw were too big, so um, it's been a great challenge and it's been wonderful. Dan does all my uh, filming, so it's a, a nice reward for him for him to take something on shot that he didn't know anything about. A little bit of a surprise at the end of our three day hunt in the uh, French Alps. Uh, we've had a fantastic trip, haven't we, Dan? Yeah. Been really good, so very rewarding. We've been with really good company. Really professional guides like Charlie. <laughs> He did a fantastic job yesterday with my chamois. Um, I thought the mouflon was going to be a little bit easier on the legs this morning, but it wasn't. <laughs> We've climbed a small mountain. If I pin pan around here, you can see the kind of landscape we're in. Absolutely fantastic. On a wonderful area. Now, Charlie, you can find me a monster stein <laughs> We've seen some earlier on, and <laughs> uh, some uh, uh, alpine ibex, and I've never hunted them. And um, they manage them very, very carefully here. Uh, we got them on film, I think, didn't we, Dan? Yeah. Um, so you will see those later on. Um, but uh, we weren't here to hunt them. But we had a fantastic time. Now we've got to get this down, get it cleaned, and get back, and then fly back this afternoon back to England and uh, back on the Fallabuck route. Yep. <laughs> it's a wrap. Good dad. Okay, so uh, we've just finished breakfast and uh, we're in, in the hunting camp and everybody's really excited because my friend Tim, he's been out all morning, he's just come back and, and this is a beautiful ram he shot, um, long distance and um, it's took them two hours to get it back down. So we've had breakfast, we've got a rush for the plane. It's now nearly 12 o'clock and uh, yeah, look at this for a trophy. Fantastic in the French Alps. Such a great hunt we've had. The weather's been absolutely beautiful. All the wonderful browns and yellows and autumn colours. It's just been such a great few days. I got my chamois, my son got a, a young mouflon lamb and, and my mate Tim shot a fantastic mouflon ram. Look at this, fantastic. Anyway, till next time, we've got to go.